My name's Oscar and welcome to a Subnautica kind of not really a video, it's more of a showing off of Subnautica as an entire game. Um, so basically I've been spending a lot of time on the Subnautica Trello recently which basically tells you basically everything that is basically basically happening at the moment in the world of developers for Subnautica and it's really really interesting to look at just like scrolling endlessly endlessly on the work that they're doing doing done got to do eta it's crazy but like there's tons of things on here that will give you complete access to pretty much things that you would not expect to even be in the game like uh like you get access to things that aren't even in the game that you've never even heard of before so in six days from when i've recorded this hopefully they will have done this 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 all of this all of this i'm scrolling through now will hopefully be done by the 16th, I'm guessing is what that means there. But and anyway, so let's go through the doing things. So they've added new cliff textures, that's not really particularly interesting, but this is what interests me. I wasn't particularly sure what it meant by Sea Dragon or Leviathan. No siree have they renamed the Sea Emperor. Look at that. Concept art is a fantastic part of this game. Like, look at that, Jesus Christ, that's so cool. And this, these game developers seem to have an obsession with the word Leviathan, but um, it's definitely doing well for them. I mean, look at that. That is so cool. And then they've done, um, I don't think they've, that's just concept image. Model is not done yet. Okay, so we know that. Then there's this, the Warper. Now, they've got, uh, there is actually a Sketchfab model for this, and I'll show that off later, but look. Uh, that that is fantastic but i'll show off the um sketchfab so that's the warper want to give away the soundtrack cute fish etc for free that everyone buys it okay so before you if you buy this game before it gets to version 1.0 you get all that free that's pretty cool uh vertical base connect that's what i really want really want um base stop flooding with bulkheads that's already been done hasn't it blood kelp zone that'll be so so cool um crab squid r crab squid generic base room i can't wait for this round rooms that is gonna be so cool a bird there's a there's a bird they're gonna add birds into this game i mean look at that that's so that's so cool isn't it it surprises me where the heck they get these ideas from from this game and there's Emperor Leviathan animations. Now I'm not going to show these off because I'm pretty sure that this is probably copyrighted. Um, because it's all made by them. And they probably don't want people showing it off. So I'm going to put this specific link in the uh, description for you guys to look at. Um, because it's very interesting. So go and have a look at this. And you'll be able to go and see the actual animations. Uh, and then we have the exosuit animations as all of these. I'll put these in as well, the description. And they've done the moon pool as well, haven't they? That's really cool. I'll, uh, I'll put the moon pool in the description as well if you want to go and see that. And by the look of some of these animations, you can actually... Um, you can actually park your exosuit in it as well. So now we're going to move on to the... Uh, Sketchfab Fox 3D Art. Uh, this is a guy, um, he's obviously probably a developer of um, Subnautica, but he makes 3D models for the Subnautica people, so it's, it's really cool actually. And uh, you get like things like this, um, the crab squid, this is going to be a new, uh, new feature in the game soon, I'm hoping. Um, it takes a while for the thing to load up fully, it might take a lot longer because I'm recording the actual thing. But as you can see, the details already going up loads, there you go, it's pretty much fully loaded now. Look at that, that is so cool. And these are fully 3D, you can move them around all you want. Look at the amount of detail in this. 
crazy absolutely crazy and then we have other things as well i won't go through all of them the starfish there's a cute fish obviously there's a rock punch and i'll just show off the things that aren't actually in the game yet there will be uh, because these will be the things that people want to see. Uh, so this is the rock puncher. I'm guessing that this camera is about the same size as a human kind of thing. So if we're standing here, let's say, it's probably going to be about that big. I'm not sure. The exosuit final, which... This is basically what the exosuits are going to look like. Um, by the look of this, it looks like there's going to be two different types of exosuits. It's going to be like a drilling mining one, perhaps, because it looks like some kind of drill here. And there's going to be one where you can pick things up, perhaps. Maybe there'll be a choice of which one you want to build. Um, but look, the interior is fully, fully exploded. Like, uh, not exploded. It's fully, like, detailed and everything. Everything is, like, pristine detail. Everything is fantastic looking. Um, so they are going to be absolutely amazing and I cannot wait for the exosuits. Fully coloured warper uploaded a day ago. Now this, this is probably the best looking thing on the, uh, I, look, look, it even has shadowing the 3D models on this, it's crazy. Look at that. Isn't that incredible? Look, I've only just, I did not know that, that that was there. I've seen this a second ago. I looked at it before, um, actually put it on full screen. Why didn't I not do that? That's so stupid of me. Um, yeah, a lie. Um, that's amazing. You can see it's like internal organs. That's so freaky. So these guys will basically be able to make portals and uh, hopefully, I'm guessing in the future, you'll be able to um, follow them into the portals, I'm guessing is the idea, and it'll lead you somewhere, perhaps to the Sea Emperor's base of operations i do not know this is probably one of the newest coolest things i've ever seen there's feota there actually he's a cool youtuber you can go check him out um this is the thing that surprised me the most probably apart from that warper there that surprised me a lot you so imagine you're going to be standing about this tall you look up and you see this look at this see how crazy that is The amount of detail, seriously, it like amazes me. Look at that, that's his bum. <laughs> Look at that, that's his bum. Sorry. But it's like little feelers. Well, not little, humongous feelers. This is going to be a gigantic creature. Uh, hopefully peaceful. By the looks of it, it will probably be peaceful. Um, it is nice to have some friendly giants. Although, it's got spikes. Hmm, maybe it could hit you with its... Oh no, that looks like a leg. I think if it tried to hit you with that, it would just fall over and hit its face on the floor. But that is seriously amazing. So is that its mouth? How does it eat? That looks like its kind of jaw. So does it... Does this open at the end here? Is that his mouth? I'm quite confused as to the biology of this animal. Um, all of it is explorable if you want to go and see it. It's crazy cool uh just gonna have a look at it also gonna have a look at the leviathan and the uh yeah look at the leviathan animations and the exosuit animations and the moon pool animations because they're freaking amazing so go and do that uh look on the trello subscribe to it and all that kind of stuff um make an account on trello it's really easy uh just make one go in and it's all there and uh yeah so just go do it um, sorry if this was like quite boring compared to maybe other videos, but I just wanted to show this off because it's crazy. So, you know, thanks for watching. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Try my friends.